The Fix Drawing tool located in the Modify tab is used to correct mistakes in your design or drawing that prevent accurate toolpaths from being created. It's very helpful when you're importing a DXF file that might contain unknown errors, like gaps, or overlaps, or double lines. So to demonstrate how to use the Fix tool, I'm going to start by drawing a rectangle. And I'm going to purposely overlap one corner, and then leave a small gap in one corner. So if I left my design as is, with the gap and the overlap, I would go ahead and move it to cam mode, and I would have a warning screen that pops up telling me that I have open geometry and that a toolpath cannot be generated. So I'll press OK, and you can see that there's nothing in my cam screen. I'll go back to CAD, and I'll go ahead and locate the fix tool. Once I select my tool, I can click search issues, and the tool will scan my design for any errors in the geometry. So the green circles will indicate, for example, the gaps and the overlap. Once my errors are detected, I can go ahead and either click the Fix All button provided by the Fix tool to automatically fix my errors, or I can go in and manually fix the errors myself. Now I'm going to go ahead and actually undo what I just fixed to show you what would happen if my joint tolerance was too small. So I'm going to set it to point two, search my drawing, and you'll see nothing is detected. That's because my joint tolerance has to be larger than any errors in my design. So I'll go back, I'll increase my joint tolerance, and search my drawing again, and then I'll have green circles show up. And I'll fix that, and then continue on to cam mode, and now you see that a toolpath of my design has been generated. So going back to CAD mode, there's one more error that my fix tool can detect, and that's a double line. So I'm drawing the second line directly above one of the lines of the rectangle I already created. And you can't see it, it looks like there's nothing wrong with it, but when I use my fix tool and search my drawing, if you look closely you can see that where that double line was, it's highlighted in green. So I can go ahead, click fix all, and it'll get rid of my double line, and it'll only be a single line. So now I can take my design, transfer it over to CAM mode, generate my toolpath, and then take it to CNC mode where my G code will be created and my design will be ready to be cut out with no gaps, no overlaps, and no double lines.